When plastic is dumped into the environment, they enter waterways and break into smaller microplastics. These microplastics are consumed by phytoplankton, which play an important role in the biosphere because they consume carbon dioxide from the air and produce up to 20% of all oxygen globally. Consuming microplastics greatly reduces the ability of plankton to remove carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and thus contributes to climate change. To educate more people about the problem of plastic in the ocean and its effect on climate change, I created a simple but fun game. In my game, the player controls a shark named Bruce. The goal of the game is to rescue his friend, Princess Sharky, who is trapped in an area of the ocean because of trash. Bruce must save his friend by swimming to her through an ocean full of trash by dodging the trash and eating fish along the way. To beat the game, you must reach Princess Sharky in under one minute. The factors to watch out for are hunger level and plastic consumption. The hunger level will increase over time and can be lowered by consuming fish. The plastic consumption bar increases every time a piece of trash is consumed. Consuming plastic causes you to swim slower, while eating fish makes you swim faster. If you consume too much plastic, you will have failed the mission, and the game will display information about marine animal plastic consumption on the screen. When the hunger bar fills up from not eating enough food, the game ends. When marine animals consume plastic, they believe they're full when they're actually starving because the plastic takes up space in their stomach. In the game, there are fishing nets that appear during the rescue mission. If you touch a fishing net, you become entangled in it and the game instantly ends. These fishing nets kill hundreds of millions of marine animals annually because they become entangled in these nets where they choke and starve. If you fail to reach Princess Sharky before the time runs out, she will suffocate from the trash and you will lose. And finally, if you manage to reach Princess Sharky on time, you will win the game. However, the amount of plastic eaten will be displayed on the screen. I hope my game will not only inform players how trash harms the ocean and contributes to climate change, but also inspire them to take action to protect our ocean and prevent climate change.